the question is a 50 year old woman develops pink macules and papules on her hands and forearms in association with a sore throat the lesions are target like so this is the most important point over here with a dusky violet center a diagnosis of erythema multiforme is made the most important information obtained from the patient's history is so based on this the uh, let's look at the option the patient has been using tampons the patient is taking phenytoin the patient has never had measles no other family members have a sore throat so over here what we need to remember is the an important information is if the patient had had measles so means it's a viral infection and usually patients with viral infections would present at a later point with this particular autoimmune disease which is erythema multiforme which is a skin disease and one more thing that we need to know about erythema multiforme is it is classified into three types we will get into the details of it later okay the patient has been using tampons again this is not a very significant finding no other family members have a sore throat see if no other family members had a sore throat that means the patient is having a is reacting to a particular lesion but over here uh, it can be seasonal also like the have the uh, appearance of a sore throat or one of the sim like symptoms of sore throat can be due to seasonal allergy as well so this is again not a significant finding so the answer over here is the patient is taking phenytoin so let's read about erythema multiforme so this disease is basically classified into three types major minor and sgs that is stevens johnson syndrome so how do you differentiate between erythema multiforme major and sgs is major has raised atypical lesions raised atypical lesions this was again a neat medical pg question whereas sjs has uh, flat atypical lesions okay so it is a it is an acute self limiting dermatitis manifested as target or iris lesions this is what is the target so basically the darts that we throw that is how exactly it looks the concentric ring like appearance of the lesions resulting from various shades of erythema and has been given rise to the terms like target iris or bullseye appearance it is often caused by drugs it is most important to identify the offending agent phenytoin can induce erythema multiforme so this information is critical however one of the most important things is sulfa drugs are the most common drugs which cause erythema multiforme okay in addition to that barbiturates and penicillin are also causes of the disease okay thank you